Yo, yo, what's up everyone, and welcome back to another video with here, your guy, John the Finance Guy. For this one, we'll be going over, what is it, Aslan Pharmaceuticals. They just rose about, I don't know, like 50%, right, or more, but basically... They struck a deal with Roach Spark Deal, extended again, Zymeworks positive readout, um, positive earnings estimate. We'll scroll down to Aslan Pharmaceuticals here. The new preclinical pre data for the uh, ASLAN, Aslan 003, as a potential treatment for AML has been published in November. So we're seeing here um, the findings support the Aslan 003's potential as a potent human dihydro rotate dehydrogenase DHODH inhibitor and novel target for differentiation therapy with the favorable toxicity profile. Um, so I guess we'll look here. We have the the potential treatment here. We'll do our best to really go through and analyze what this is about and see if this is could be a potential um, winner in terms of um, really turning this uh, stock around. If we go at the all-time IPO last year, apparently, May 2018 at $8, and since then it's been down quite a bit here at one dollars fifty um this could be a potential rebound will it break through and make new highs who knows we'll see but let's see it's an orally active potent inhibitor licensed from emerald 2012 and a non-topical Dermatological indications. Okay, let's see if they have anything interesting. They're at phase two. Um, so they're at discovery preclinical pre phase one, phase two. But as we can see since then, it's been kind of like even with the positive news, it kind of goes up and down, as we can see with the graph. Um, I'm not sure if there's anything that's different um, about this. I guess the most important part would be the uh, pivotal, this this stage will be definitely the most important in terms of going forward on how the stock proceeds. Many AML patients are elderly. Aslan could allow these patients. So it's all, so far, most of it's very speculative. There hasn't been a certain actual set in stone data represents about 85%, so talking about patients again, um, partnered with Almeral for the development as a leading health skin professional science. So maybe they may make a breakout discovery, otherwise uh, um, there isn't much data or information to go off of currently, I would say, based upon just this news. Uh, 
Let's see here. So it's just so far it's just on speculation on on hype. I believe it's like a pump and dump. So I would say it would probably a uh, 50 maybe drop again. Um, I wouldn't say there's a very strong chance based on current um, news and information that this will break out until for for next year. I'm not too sure, can't say for sure, but I will definitely be keeping a watch on this stock and hopefully I recommend all everyone who's viewing this to do the same. Um, definitely large plays ahead on the long and short, so please trade carefully and have a wonderful day.